finding this value that is something that you can implement um, in, in, in looking at that holistically and then deciding what you're going to go, what you're going to spend your time on, because you can spend time doing so many things. Um, I think it's, it's more important to do something, do something well. You know, what are your, what are your non-negotiables for your month? And how does that align with your priorities and where you want to go? Because we all have to operate a business. We all have underlying things that we have to get done to make money and survive and, and, and you know, do pay the, you know, keep the lights on. But we also have goals that we want to reach. So how can you reach those goals? You have to set up small tasks that you consistently do over time until you finish your, 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 big, your big tasks. Why are you doing this task? Why are you spending time you know, looking at appraisals right now when you have four potential opportunities to originate a loan? You know, what, what, what is the, what is the, what's, what is caught up inside of you? What is the fear or the worry or what it is, what it, what is it? Cause it's, it's different for everybody. What is it that's causing you to stick to those low level tasks that you don't like to do anyway, but for some reason you feel like you should. And, um, you know, it's unwinding that and it, and it can go to the very highest level of, uh, you know, I should be there helping my processor because she's super busy and I don't want her to feel like, uh, she's not supportive. Right. All right. Well, um, you know, but you also could, should be, if you want to reach your goals, how about making those 10 phone calls that are going to, you know, connect with past clients that uh, need annual mortgage reviews instead of helping your process or process a file because she happens to be busy right now out of guilt. You know, what's going on inside? You know, what's, what's holding you back? What's that upper limit belief that's holding you back from really achieving your goals? And again, most of the time it's, it's the, it's the uh, shoulds. It's the things that they feel like you feel, I feel we should be doing instead of the things that we know we could be doing that will create ultimate success. 